Look at this map. This is Earth's most southern continent and you don't know what is going on here and why these borders overlap. The continent covered in slowly melting eternal ice was the last major landmass humanity discovered and up to the late 1700s was completely unknown to mankind. Over the years many tried to conquer the continent and raised the planned flag at the South Pole started. Many deaths later the Norwegian explorer Roald Amundsen successfully reached the pole on the 14th December 1911. With the arrival of humans, research bases and borders came as well. Today 55 countries have set up bases on the continent and it is home to approximately 4800 humans during Arctic summer and around 1200 during the winter. Most of them are scientists and a quarter of them are stationed on the US base at McMurdo. Until the Arctic Treaty prohibited any further claims to the continent, 7 countries claimed portions of it. Even if some of the seven countries acknowledge each other claims, nearly all of the remaining countries do not. Up to this day, 56 governments have signed the Antarctic Treaty, which bans any exploitation of natural resources and military presence on the continent. The slowly melting ice is therefore reserved for research. And some minor tourism for prices as little as 50 grand.